a mathematical socks problem. So in my sock drawer, there are red socks and blue socks. What I want to know is, if I go into my drawer in the dark and start randomly pulling out socks, how many socks do I need to pull out before I'm guaranteed to have a matching pair? So, on my first go, I pull out a sock. Let's say it's a red one. Worst case scenario, the next go, I pull out a different sock. Now on the third go, the sock I pull out has to be one of the two colours that I've already got, so I would have a matching pair. So if I've got two types of socks in my drawer, pulling out three socks guarantees I'm going to have a pair. But what about if I buy some more different coloured socks? So now there's some white socks in the drawer. Again, how many socks do I need to pull out before I am guaranteed to have a matching pair of socks? Well, I pull out one sock. Worst case scenario, I pull out a different type of sock for my second one. The third go, I can pull out a different sock. But now I've used all of the colours. So on the fourth go, the sock I pull out must match one of the three that I've already got. Hence, it needs four socks to guarantee a pair. Now you can see quite easily from the examples we've had that however many different types of socks you've got, worst case scenario is that you'll only need one more sock than there are different types in order to get a pair. So if you have a drawer containing 10 different colours of socks, by the time you've pulled out 11, you are guaranteed to have at least one pair in your 11 socks.